Today I'm going to show you how to tab your Bible using the Catholic Child's Teaching Bible Resource. I'm going to show you my daughter's Bible. She's already tabbed it in advance and then one Bible that we're working on tabbing. The materials that you're going to need are listed in the Catholic Child Teaching Bible. You're going to need one package of post-it flags, half inch, assorted primary colors, and one package of post-it assorted flags, bright colors. You're going to need some Paper Mate flare felt tip pens, a 12 pack in multiple colors. And you're going to need a Bible, a Catholic Bible. I used the Ignatius Press Revised Standard Catholic Bible. When you start tabbing your Bible, you're going to go to the first chapter, which is anger, and the color flag and felt tip pen that you will use will be determined by the color frame that's around the topic. So for this one, we're going to use the light green post-it flags and the light green paper mate felt tip pen. The verses in the Catholic Child's Teaching Bible Resource are listed in order from back of the Bible to front of the Bible. And this is just an easy way to help you keep your tabs in a nice straight line per topic. So, anger is our first topic. And our first verse is in the book of James, chapter 1, verses 19 to 21. So, we took our green post-it flag and we put it right up here in the far left hand corner of the right side page. Now even if your verse is over here on the left hand side of the page you are still going to tab on the right hand side. So anger is our first one. We put our first tab here at the top and then we took our pen and came down here and we tabbed, we highlighted the verse. And then we moved on to our next verse. Our next verse listed is in Ephesians. It is Ephesians chapter 4 verses 31 to 32. So we took our second green post-it flag, the light colored one, and we put it right on top of the previous flag. See if you see that? We put it right on top trying to keep it in a nice straight line. You'll see in this example that one of our verses for anger is actually on the left-hand side of the page. It's in Galatians chapter 5, which is on the left-hand side of the page of our Bible, but we're going to tab on the right-hand side of the page. Again, this is to help keep those tabs in a straight line, makes it easy to tab the Bible as you go through, and it makes it just a nice uniform line of tabs as you're flipping through trying to find the verse when you need it. Our next topic is complaining and the colors we used for complaining are purple. Again, you can tell which color to use by the outline of the frame. So we took our post-it flag, the purple, and we took our purple Papermate pen. We found our verse 
in James chapter 5, verse 9. We put this tab just a little bit over from our first green one. Let me show you here. So see, we moved it over just a little bit. You can see this is why we go from front to back, so that way we can just layer them right on top of each other in a straight line. So each topic has its own color, and it will have its own marking place. You can see here on this page that we also have a couple other verses that have been highlighted in their different color. So the multiple colors just make it easy to pick out and the tabs that go along the top of the Bible and down the side are a quick reference point for you. So we've used the post-it tabs to flag our Bible all the way across the top. We ended here on red, which is God's love. Again, this particular verse is on the left-hand side of the Bible, but we placed the tab on the right-hand side. And as we changed topics, we just moved the tabs over, kept them in a line. When you get to God's love, which is this last tab, the red one, then you're going to turn and you're going to start gossip here with the green. Remember to start at the back of your Bible. This just makes it easy to keep those tabs in a line. And you don't have to be meticulously perfect. As you can see, we're a little off here on some of them. But it's just helpful for them to each have their own space. Now, once you're finished tabbing your Bible, you will have gone all the way across the top, and then you will have gone down the side with all of the topics listed in the Catholic Child's Teaching Bible resource. And you can see we did our best to keep them in a straight line, each color, each topic. You can see with my daughter's Bible, she has already put the tabs for the books. So her Bible is tabbed with the books, and these tabs did not make a difference. They don't interfere with it at all. As a matter of fact, it made it helpful for her in order to find the book. Then when you have a particular issue come up, or if you want to use this as a daily Bible study with your children, you just go to the topic you need, lying, excuses, gossip, gratitude. So here we would go to gratitude, and we can see gratitude is yellow. The frame around it is yellow. And so we would come to our Bible. We would grab our yellow tabs. And we would start looking up our gratitude verses. Again, this can be used in the time that you need correction. Or it can be used just as a daily Bible study. However, your family needs to use this Bible resource. There's more verses on gratitude. Here we are at our last section in the Catholic Child's Teaching Bible Resource, which is Apologetics. It has the dark green frame, so we know that we're going to use our dark green Papermate pen and our dark green flag. This is my daughter's Bible. It's already been flagged. It's a completed project. And there you have a Bible that's been tabbed using the Catholic Child's Teaching Bible Resource. I know this will become a valuable asset to your family as you learn through God's Word how to conquer your vices and to strengthen your virtues.